How you doing, Major League Motorsports community and friends? This is MLR Danger Kid here, as known as EJ. You guys know me here right now, so let's get into this video. I'm doing a new series of videos. I'm going to be doing all with the crew too, and that will be our comparison series. And so I'm just going to give you a little brief rundown of what that basically will mean. So what we're doing is we're going to take a car to, I mean, two cars, maybe a collection of cars, you know, I want to kind of get a little bit more feedback from this video than normal. So I can basically give you guys some good content that I can basically put out for you all to absorb and be able to basically grasp the whole general idea of that. So let's go ahead and get into this one. So my first example comparison, uh, they dropped these, uh, this car here, the new Audi S1 EKS RX Quattro quite a little bit ago. And so I wanna go ahead and get into it. Um, another honorable mention would be the Cadillac Escalade. Um, it's a really good, a rally cross discipline car. Um, you don't go wrong if you choose this car either. It's pretty fast, but getting back into the Audi S1, um, what I'm gonna be putting up, up against is the Evo WRC 05. So let's just, just get into the EKS um, Quattro. So it's a really, really, really tricky car. It's not like most cars. It's not as balanced in for say it's 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 balanced in speed more say because it can it can get up to speed fairly quickly but as far as you being able to control that speed it's a, it's a little different um some people have said that it's a little twitchy well what i like to call is it, it's a it's really loose on the rear end so i just do my best to conceive and be able to drive it as best as I possibly could. Now, I will say I was a comparison. I have the most fun driving this car because it's very, like people say it's, oh, it's, it's twitchy, it's this and it's that, but I, I like, I like it. It's, it's not that bad. It's not anything unbearable for me. Um, others may feel this, feel a little different. But for me, it's a great car to drive, and I think it is definitely one of the top tier vehicles in the game as far as uh, rally cross goes. Um, it's pretty good and pretty decent. It can definitely get the job done if you're trying, if you're new to the game and have a little bit more of questions on, oh, what rally car should I buy, or what should I save to grab? Um, I would say this one's not a bad choice. I, I, I like the fact that it's newer, I love the way it sounds, it sounds amazing, I think it's one of the best sounding rally cars in the game, it definitely captures that we're into it, so the next thing I want to go ahead and do is I want to show you guys the, the pro settings that I am running, now they may be a little bit questionable because everything's a little different for everyone else, everyone has different goals they want to achieve when they're tuning a car. So when I'm when I'm doing my pro settings, sometimes I drive them stock without anything done to the car at all. But with this tune here on the Audi, you'll see that you'll see that um, I have a, my compression in the rear a little bit higher than most. Um, that's because I want to keep the front end a little compressed. So yes, it. it it is a little counterintuitive when you think about it, but um, I, I started with that and I kept moving along with it. And so that is my result. Um, one thing I may recommend you do, um, if it's a little too twitchy, I would scale back the compression, maybe one or two notches and see where that goes from there. But okay, so now we're getting into the WRC05. Uh, Evo Rally car. I love this car. Um, honestly, um, it's it's pretty balanced and well versed in itself. Um, it's pretty it's pretty self-explanatory. 
you want to get the job done easily with no repercussions, no, no, no little to no little to no effort of driving. I think this is the car here. Um, I may question its speed at sometimes, but um, I think it's the fast, fastest. Well, I wouldn't say fast, it's top tier, because the Audi, you can definitely make it as fast if you have the right settings for it. But it's, you know, that's subjective because of the drivers, a lot of things that goes into what makes the car the fastest anyway. So I think the Evo is most definitely the better and more enjoyable of the two to drive, but when it comes down to it, I think that um, I think I like I like the Audi a little bit more in this game. Even though I will say I will differ in cars, I love the Evo more as a car, far say than the Audi because it's something. I, I love JDM cars. I love Japanese cars. So I'm a little biased towards the Evo, but the Audi has definitely caught my eye and. I love the way it has character and personality. Not saying that the Evo doesn't. It's just the Evo, it's just, you know, you just get in and go. You don't have to really do too much to it to make it do what you want it to do. So I, I think that alone is its benefit. And with that alone, that, that there, um, let's get into the pro settings. So. Uh, it's basically nearly the same tune as my um, I always just said uh, with this car I can be a little I can stiffen it a little bit more but I don't want to stiffen it too much because you are driving off-road and stiff suspension on off-road is not typically something you would warrant to anyone because let's just face it yeah, you, the suspension is constantly traveling and you don't want it to be too yeah. stiff in applications because when you're on when you're riding over hard bumps you don't want to have a rock hard suspension because that's not something ideal but uh i think that um you guys know my choice thus far um i choose the evo as far as better car to drive but the car i like the most would be the audi i think the audi is definitely definitely cut out for what it's meant to do in its case um i think that you definitely don't go wrong with either choice but the audi just has so much personality i mean it, it appeals to me a little bit more and so there it is um if you guys wondering why i'm looking at the screen it's because i'm actually commentating over this as i'm editing it editing it, it. Uh, I don't have a strong graphics card right now, so I can't uh, do a live commentary. But that's something in the works, and that's something I'm working on getting. Um, if you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe and hit the notification bells. I'll be dropping a little bit more content. Plus, pretty soon, I'm going to be doing a Crew 2 uh, giveaway for those of you who are on the PlayStation 4 platform. Thank you so much for your support and following. Uh, shout out to DJ Alchemix, of course, um, for being really, really great supporters. Uh, thank you, uh, Mr. Sid Wodge, for being such a such a talented artist and helping me uh, with some logo issues. So I can definitely put those things out. So thank you. You again. Um, like and subscribe, like I said, and uh, we'll see you soon. Take care.